Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. Today I'm going to try this uh, pot pasta. Uh, this one is the macaroni and cheese. This is actually from London. Um, we bought this at Poundland for a pound. Um, so these are like kind of like um, the pot, the uh, cup of noodles and stuff like that we have over here. This one just happens to be pasta. Um, calorie wise, it says it right here. 269 calories uh, for the cup. So that's that's not too healthy bad. Um, not much else to say about it except how you make it. So we're going to uh, peel back the lid halfway. We're going to pour boiling water into the fill line. Stir thoroughly to the bottom, replace lid, and leave for five minutes while you check out pot, at pot noodle. That's funny. Um, stir again and then... Um, Oh, it goes a follow. Okay, I was going to say, what? Uh, so anyway, basically, you're going to add boiling water to this, stir it up, and then let it sit for five minutes. So I'm going to just, um, I'm going to use a cup and uh, fill the cup up with uh, with water and put it in the microwave. And, uh, and that's how I'm going to boil the water. So let me show you see what it looks like inside. So that's about halfway. You can see you got your pasta and the, the cheese, the seasonings and all that stuff in there. So I'm gonna get my um, water in the microwave and uh, I'll be back. All right, here's my, this is the cup I use. It's, I put a cup and a half in there for almost three minutes and it started really good and good and bubbly. So it's definitely boiling. So I'm gonna fill this up to the filling. You can see the black line in there. Um, you can use a coffee cup too if you really wanted to. It's just, uh, it's harder to pour with a coffee cup. If you got a, little me a glass measuring cup, it's quite a bit easier. Okay, so there's that, very, very hot. Just let you know, very hot. So I'm going to stir this up really good and make sure you get the bottom. Like they said, you want to make sure you get all that powder. And that pasta literally feels um, uncooked. So okay, I think that's stirred up pretty good. So I'm going to set a timer for five minutes and like recover this. Go over there, pasta. Ouch. So I'm going to recover this and it lets it for five minutes. I'll be back. All right, I had it sitting for five minutes. I just put the fork on there to kind of hold the lid down because I didn't even want it to, to pull back up. So, yeah, still looks a little watery to me. Let's stir it up a little bit. Oh, no, that's thicker than I thought. Yeah, it's not bad. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to stir this up really good. Probably let it cool off for just a minute. Probably not long though, because I mean, boiling water in five minutes does cool off pretty quick. But um, anyway, I'll be right back. All right, so here we go. This is the bike. That's what it looks like close up. <laughs> the noodles aren't quite cooked all the way through. Actually, it was, well, most of it was cooked, but then I got a little crunchy bit in there. Now those were fun. Um, these are okay. There's not a lot of flavor to them. I mean, you get you get some of the cheese flavor, but not a lot. Not bad. Very, 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 very plain. Um. If you're in the, in the United States, um, you get more flavor in the like, like the Kraft macaroni and cheese bowls that you can do the same thing with. You basically put water in there and you microwave them. Um, these are really bland, actually. They're very, very, very plain. Um, if you're in the UK and you're a pot noodle lover, you'll have to leave, let me know if you really like the, the mac and cheese version because it's uh, it's kind of kind of boring. You'd have to put some, some pepper in here or something to spice it up a bit because it's uh, pretty plain. So I'm gonna give this one a three. It's not, it's not bad, and um, it definitely. Uh, I feel like it's got a crack in it, but it doesn't. Um, it's, um, it's not horrible. It's just, just plain. It's, it doesn't have a lot of flavor to it at all. So, um, and the noodles, I got that one crunchy one, but the rest of them have been fine. The rest of them have been cooked okay. So, um, so I guess maybe that one was kind of sitting on the top, maybe out of the water or something. I don't, I don't know. Um, you should probably set it for like three minutes and then stir it up again and then let it sit for another three minutes. I mean, uh, two or three minutes, but uh, I don't know if that would that would make it cooler because you've let the steam out or what, I don't, I don't know. But anyway, um, 
they're okay. Are they worth a pound, which is like a dollar thirty something here? Um, yeah, maybe I guess so. Although I think, like I said, in the states, the macaroni and cheese balls are much much cheaper and they have a lot more flavor to them. So uh, if you're in the UK and this is all you got, yeah, I mean it's a good cheap cheap uh, lunch, I guess. So anyway, I'm gonna give it a three. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching.